This is NSCA's Business Question Series. My name is Mark Finner with RISE Performance Group, and I am an NSCA Member Advisory Council partner. Today's question is, what specific behaviors need to change to build a strong corporate culture? And first, it's important to recognize that different cultures require different types of behaviors. Think of competitive culture versus a collaborative culture versus a creative culture. So a great place to start is to get your leadership team together and identify the behaviors that are holding your teams back and then look at what do we need to build as the positive behaviors to eliminate the negatives. And across all my coaching clients, I, I tend to run into a, a recurring theme around placing blame or making excuses, and they tend to rely around the customer. You know, we blame the customer, the customer's late, customer didn't get me what I needed, blaming a coworker, I'm waiting on another department to get me what I need to move forward, or blaming a process. The process isn't working, so I'm stuck. And something that you can do to help move your team forward is to model and teach the circle of control. And the circle of control starts with in the middle are the activities or the behaviors that are most within our control. These are the things that we can wake up every day and do ourselves. The second ring in the circle of control are those things that are within our influence. So if we do the things right that are within our control, we're betting we're going to get the results that we want that are within our influence. And then the third is the things that are outside of our control. And the art is in focusing ourselves and our teams on what we can control, trusting what's within our influence, and doing everything in our power not to be distracted by the things that are outside of our control. If you can teach this to your team and get them to take more personal responsibility, I guarantee it'll build you a stronger corporate culture and put you on your way to achieving the goals you have for your organization.